Hello everyone I will tell you in this video about top 10 dog breeds that can kill a lion. Like I have said above, there is no way one dog can kill one lion. The dog that will face the lion one on one will more likely turn cold after fighting a lion. Lions are big and powerful cats. That is why they got the nickname, King of the Jungle. There is a reason why lions got that nickname. With that nickname, it is already obvious why one dog will fail if it tries to kill a lion. Lions got that nickname because they deserve it, and the nickname is right for them because of the power and fierceness they have. However, there is still a chance a dog will kill a lion but only if there are multiple of them. The number of dogs that are required to kill one lion will be discussed later. Before we go into those numbers, let's take a look first at some of the toughest dog breeds that can fight a lion one-on-one. -on -one. They have a chance to kill a lion one-on-one, -on -one, but the probability is low. Here are the top 10 robust breeds of dogs that can fight and have a chance to kill a lion. Number 1. Irish Wolfhound Irish Wolfhound heart is as big as their size. They are gentle, noble, sensitive, loyal, and easygoing. Irish Wolfhounds can run at great speed, but they are still very gentle when around the house. The Irish Wolfhound is one of the tallest dog breeds in the world. A male Irish Wolfhound stands at least 32 inches tall and weighs at least 100 minus 130 pounds, while the female Irish Wolfhound stands at least 30 inches tall and weighs 105 pounds. However, there are some larger Irish Wolfhounds. Some males average 33 to 35 inches and weigh 140 to 190 pounds, while some females may average 32 to 34 inches and may weigh 115 to 140 pounds. It depends on their diet and how active they are. The healthier the diet they intake, the more likely they will grow bigger and stronger. The bite force of an Irish Wolfhound is 224 size. They can kill a pit bull and other breeds of dog. However, how about a lion? Yes, Irish Wolfhounds can kill a lion as long as there are multiple of them. One Irish Wolfhound cannot kill a lion. They need a companion. Irish Wolfhounds are also good family dogs, even though they may look scary because of their appearances. They are gentle giants and have a sweet temperament. Irish Wolfhounds are also great with children and other pets if socialized from a young age. Number 2. Rottweiler Rottweilers are a highly intelligent breed of dog. They are also confident and have lots of energy. Rottweilers are obedient, courageous, fearless, devoted, and alert dogs. That is why Rottweilers are good guard dogs for your houses. A male full-grown Rottweiler is typically 24 to 27 inches tall at the shoulder and weighs 95 to 140 pounds, while a full-grown female Rottweiler is 22 to 25 inches tall and weighs 85 to 115 pounds. Rottweiler is also one of the breeds of dogs that has a powerful and deadly bite. They have a bite force of 328 pounds, which can kill humans and other breeds of dogs. Rottweilers are good family dogs because they are loyal pets and great companions. If a Rottweiler is trained to socialize, they become a great family pet. They are also good with children, and if you raise your Rottweiler around your children, they will be protective of your children. Rottweilers have a chance to take down a lion one-on-one. -on -one. However, the probability is low. But if multiple Rottweilers will fight one lion, they have a higher chance of killing the lion. They are robust dogs but not strong enough to take a lion in a one-on-one -on -one fight. Number 3. Caucasian Shepherd Dog The Caucasian Shepherd Dogs are robust, alert, quick, powerful, dominant, and calm dogs. They are also territorial and can become aggressive when they feel that their family is not safe or in danger. This is why they are one of the best guard and family dog breeds. As I have mentioned above, Caucasian Shepherd Dogs can kill a lion. But this is theoretically because there is no strong evidence recorded. People started to believe this theory because of the size and strength of the Caucasian Shepherd Dog. Caucasian Shepherd Dogs have a bite force of 500 minus 700 psi. They are inevitably a powerful breed of dogs. Aside from their deadly bite, they are also courageous, and they fear nothing, including lions. There is no debate about why this dog is on our list. Number 4. English Mastiff English Mastiff is one of the breeds of dogs that has large size. They are also one of the dogs that have a powerful bite force. English Mastiffs are affectionate, protective, courageous, dignified, calm, and good-natured. English Mastiffs are also aggressive dogs. They became more aggressive, which is dangerous, if not trained and socialized. But even though they are aggressive, they are still loving and affectionate toward their owners. English Mastiffs are also good for older children, but not for toddlers because of their gigantic size. Male English Mastiffs can grow up to 30 inches tall and can weigh 200 pounds, while female English Mastiffs can grow up to 27 inches tall and weigh 150 minus 170 pounds. They can grow bigger than usual, depending on their diet. Many people claim that English Mastiffs can kill a lion. Yes, they can, but they need companions too to successfully slaughter one lion. They can't fight alone with one lion because they have no strength as lions. Number 5. Wolf Dogs A wolf dog is a canine produced by the mating of a domesticated dog and wolf. Wolf dogs are a strong, intelligent, and independent breed of dog. They have wolf-like attitudes but are less aggressive. Wolf dogs may also establish themselves and make themselves the leader of the pack. Wolf dogs are not a great pet for novice dog owners. 
They are not easygoing pets, and they can be very aggressive. Wolf dogs are not good pets for families that have small children and other pets. Because of their wolf-like attitudes, they have a high chance of killing a lion. However, they can't do it alone, but a pack of wolf dogs can kill a full-grown lion. Wolf dogs are hybrid dogs that can be dangerous. You don't want to mess with them. Number 6. Boer Bulldogs Like any other dogs, Boer Bulldogs are intelligent, confident, territorial, and obedient dogs. Because of their territorial attitudes, they are included in the list of good guard dogs. Boer Bulldogs are also protective of their family, which makes them good family dogs. Boer Bull males can grow up to 24 to 28 inches in height at the shoulder, while females can grow up to 22 to 25 inches. The males weigh 60 to 79 kilograms, while the females can weigh 55 to 73 kilograms. However, some Boer Bulldogs can be taller. It depends on their diet. The bite of Boer Bulldogs can exert over 450 psi. They are one of the breeds of dogs that has a powerful bite. Boer Bull is a breed of dog that is trained to kill lions and leopards. Many people claim that Boer Bulls are capable of fighting a full-grown leopard and even lions to death. Boer Bulls have no chance to fight a lion alone, but they can fight a leopard without companions. In simple words, one Boer Bull can take down one leopard, but if we talk about lions, Boer Bulls need companions to slaughter the king of the jungle. Number 7. Neapolitan Mastiff The Neapolitan Mastiff is a quiet, protective, and gentle dog. They are overprotective of their family, including other pets that are close to them. Neapolitan Mastiffs may look like a gentle creatures, but in reality, this dog is not an easy-going dog. They are suspicious of strangers and can be aggressive to other dogs they don't know. Male Neapolitan Mastiff can grow up to 26 to 31 inches and weigh up to 150 to 200 pounds. Their female counterparts can grow up to 24 to 29 inches and weigh up to 120 to 175 pounds. However, some Neapolitan Mastiffs grow taller than usual because of the nutrients they intake. Neapolitan Mastiff cannot kill a lion alone. They are smaller than lions, which is why they need a companion to outplay the king of the jungle. Number 8. Rhodesian Ridgeback The Rhodesian Ridgeback is a loyal, intelligent, mischievous, dignified, and sensitive dog. They are tolerant and excellent companions. Rhodesian Ridgebacks are great for children, but be careful because Ridgebacks that are more excited may knock your child by accident. A male Rhodesian Ridgeback can grow up to 25 to 27 inches and weigh 85 pounds. Females can grow up to 24 to 26 inches tall and weigh around 70 pounds. This breed was originally bred to hunt lions. They have a bite force of 224 psi. Yep, you read that right. Rhodesian Ridgebacks are bred to hunt lions. However, this doesn't mean it will be done by one Rhodesian Ridgeback. The Rhodesian Ridgeback will hunt lions with companions to have a better chance of winning. Number 9. Bloodhounds Bloodhounds are affectionate, stubborn, and gentle dogs. They are great family companions because of their docile and lovable personalities. However, untrained bloodhounds may fight other dogs and strangers because they are territorial dogs. Bloodhound males can grow up to 25 to 27 inches in height and weigh 90 to 130 pounds. Females average 23 to 25 inches in height and weigh 80 to 100 pounds. Some bloodhounds may be bigger and taller, depending on their diet. Bloodhounds are robust dogs that have a bite force of 238 psi. Number 10. Dogo Argentino The Dogo Argentino is an affectionate, friendly, cheerful, loyal, protective, and tolerant dog. They are used and trained for hunting and police work, search and rescue, and military work. Dogo Argentino can be a good family dog if trained properly. Dogo Argentino is considered one of the most aggressive dogs. Even though they have friendly personalities, they can still act aggressively, especially on strangers and other dogs. Dogo Argentino was bred to hunt down large animals such as wild boar and puma. They will fight until death if required. Dogo Argentinos are large dogs that can grow up to 24 to 27 inches. Males are bigger and taller than females. The Dogo Argentinos have a powerful bite force. Their bites have a 500 psi, which can kill another dog. Because of their strength, agility, intelligence, and powerful bites, these dogs have a chance of killing a lion, but their odds will be higher if they fight with companions. Thanks for watching.